everybody. This is the Tech Special here. This layout was on display at the uh, Platonia Railroad Museum. I brought it home to work on it um, because it had some issues with the scenery. I meant to start doing this before I fixed everything. Right there, the uh, coal dealer, the uh, original scenery that I had put down, basic ballast to simulate like a gravel lot, um, it had kind of rippled up and uh, cracked all in the center of those tracks there. And that had to be pretty much just busted up with a hammer and then uh, pried up in large chips and all the small little all the small parts that broke off were essentially vacuumed up with a handy vac. There were some small little fissures in the uh, grass right there on the side of the hill that had a had opened up, so I covered those up with uh, some basic flocking and ground cover. And right there, same thing. Uh, for everywhere there's new scenery materials, you can. That's that's something I repaired. This is being filmed before I vacuum up the extra the excess material just to show you what I did. Again, I'm sorry. I meant to do this before. I, uh, I meant to shoot a quick video of what all damage had incurred this, this railroad had incurred while it was on public display. Uh, it was no fault of the museums. It was just, I guess, age. I don't know. The entire parking lot for the gas station had uh, rippled and cracked up and... Uh, it all had to completely just get ripped out. The whole scene, the whole little scene right here just had to be completely ripped out. Building removed, this little sign right here had to be taken out. Uh, this power pole, the telephone pole, was the only thing that remained in place because I glued it down before I put the scenery, the original scenery base down. Uh, the roof of the gas station had come unglued and just popped off. And the gas pumps, the little gas pumps there, the island for the gas pumps you can see right there, it uh, had actually come uh, it had actually come undone and fallen over. So that had to be reaffixed. Um, that was the biggest thing that had to be repaired was uh, and then of course there was a little bit of uh, and then there was a little bit of the, the rippling, crackling, whatever you want to call it effect on uh, where the driveway to the coal dealer met the main road there on the railroad. Now, as I said, this is all just a quick video I f I'm filming before I finish, you know, cleaning up the excess material that isn't actually glued down, but just saw an opportunity to make an interesting video for y'all. It's a little bit different than my normal real trains or Lionel trains. So, that being said, I'm gonna well, be quiet now and uh, we'll just get some good action shots of this little manifest freight running around the layout.
here oh come on Thank <laughs> you. 